It is our zero day. We are walking about three miles to an outfitter shop. It's snowing. It just started snowing again. Uh, this time it's pure snow, not the rain and snow. Yeah, we have to walk three miles just to get to the outfitter shop. And uh, the girls, um, Moss is having her, her feet are swollen, so she's sticking back and Hayes is staying with her. There's some supposedly some bike trail or some path we can go on so we don't get hit by cars. But we haven't found that yet. We just started. Yeah, so it's good to not sit around on your zero day all day. It's good to walk, but I told Maytag six miles of walking. That's not what I had in mind. That's just to the outfitter back. We're probably gonna go other places because there's lots of places in that area. My foot is tight today. So I'll keep you posted about what we're doing on our zero day. The mountains are gorgeous. Yeah, that's a giant hot dog and a giant hamburger. Um, hmm. I have no clue what that's all about. We're still walking on the trail. We've hiked a, while, a mile so far. I don't know if you can see the ducks in the water. So, I just get a text from Moss and from Hayes and they're getting an Uber to where we're going. They didn't think about that while we were there. We still have like a mile. It is a pretty bike path. Lots of ponds. I don't know, this looks kind of scummy over here. But, uh, yeah. I'm on a quest to locate something and two places are sold out. Ah, it's getting cold. We took off our... Now we're walking right into the snow. <laughs> we're almost to the outfitter, which is good. <sighs> Woo. So we walk through the downtown. Now um, we're in neighborhoods because we're walking back a different way to the hotel because apparently there's no restaurants. It's Saturday and most of the places downtown are closed. <laughs> so now we're walking a mile to this hibachi grill, which I love hibachi, um, which is supposedly on the way back to the hotel. And supposedly we could take this road which right now is very residential, all the way back to the hotel. We shall see. It's definitely an adventure. <sighs> Wonder how much, how many miles we're gonna end up hiking today. We could have just slack packed. <laughs> Although down here, it's not bad, but up there and the mountains it is. There were a ton of hikers downtown. That's the only people we saw actually. 
we didn't see any normal people. Just, just us hikers. Some nice houses. Very nice. nice Very nice houses. So we just ate at this hibachi house restaurant on Carolina Avenue. So if you're in Irwin, you definitely want to come here. The prices were fantastic. The food was delicious. And uh, yeah, it's really good. We have, I think, a two mile hike back to the hotel from this point. And it's cold. It feels like it's getting colder. Whew. We just <laughs> we just ran into a guy in his front yard who uh, told us the closer we get to Johnson City, the meaner the people get, and to be careful in their in their woods and. Uh, and said all kinds of stuff I can't say on film. But I wanted to show you, not these mountains here, but the mountains right behind, the higher elevation ones, There's, it's snowing right now. You can see the snow sticking up there. And our next section is high mountains. We're gonna be, uh, I forget, what the elevation is. We're only at, uh, I said the elevation yesterday. Here, we're gonna be up a couple thousand more, like 4,000 more feet higher or more. So I'm very happy we're not up in those mountains right now because it is cold just walking in town. I think we're within a, Point six miles or something to back to the hotel I'm hoping anyway because I'm ready to get out of this wind and we do have things we have to do we have to do our food set our food up and um, we have to do laundry get our gear packed up and you know I don't worry things like pay bills stuff like that edit videos but, uh, man, it's been interesting today on our zero day. <laughs> we do not physically see our hotel, but we're pretty sure it's down here. But as soon as we get on the other side of this hill, we're going to see it. It's cold. There it is, over there on the left. There's the bridge we crossed over and went down under on that bike path. Yay. Okay, I had to stand up for this. All right, so we're, we're here with Hayes and Moss, and we're eating dinner before we go out tomorrow back northbound. All right, here's my meal, right? Here's Hayes's meal. That's Moss's meal. And then here we have, this is Maytag's meal. <laughs> that is one meal. Like, how, how in the world is Maytag? How are you gonna eat all that, Maytag? I'm not. <laughs> well, I'll get back to you on this. It's 9 o'clock. I'm going to go ahead and end the video for the night. So, Maytag did not eat all of that food. He did eat a lot of it. He ate almost all of it. But, like, we were sitting there for a little bit, and um, I said, I'm going to go get an ice cream, even though it's cold and snowy outside. And he's like, oh, I'm going to, I want an ice cream. So, he did eat ice cream after eating a lot of food. We, um, I have, uh, I have to pay a couple more bills and, um, finish packing my pack and go to bed because we're getting picked up at 7 a.m. tomorrow. 
I'll see you tomorrow.